How's it going, everybody? This is Blue Hair Dave. So I just want to get this out real quick. I'm not going to even going to edit it or anything. I'm just going to get straight to the point and give you all the information you're looking for because I've had some stuff where I did these stimulus payment details and a lot of people are asking, and it's pretty popular, where are my checks? So I'm going to give you some troubleshooting ideas on how to make get your stimulus check faster and how to get it quicker and if you didn't get it at all, how to check on it, okay? So I'm going to have some links in the description below, so make sure you check out the links for the appropriate website to go to. And always, even if you feel better Googling, always make sure you go to the government site and you're not gonna get fished by some random uh, link. So make sure it's the real deal uh, and it's the actual IRS website, okay? Always gotta say that. So uh, watch this entire video. It's not very long, it's super short and it's gonna get right to the point. Make sure you watch the whole thing because there's a couple different points I'm gonna make on why you didn't get your stimulus check or why it might be delayed, okay? So make sure you check that out. Um, and also subscribe right now uh, and give me some likes. Why? Because it helps other people see this when there's likes. It helps it go up in the algorithm and other people can see the video. Um, my videos have been really uh, getting a lot more attention lately and it's because you're hitting the like button. So please do, okay? Uh, and there's tens of millions of people still waiting on their checks. Uh, I guess over 90 million people have already gotten theirs. So if you're one of those 90 million people, awesome you're probably stoked because you got your check. Um, but there's still tens of millions of people still waiting on their checks, and if you're one of them, keep watching this video, okay? So I'm gonna explain how you can speed up getting your check. Reason number one why, uh, if you got it, you probably filed a direct deposit, and you signed up at the payment portal, and you just didn't get it, okay? If that's what happened, um, it, you're probably still waiting on it because they're going by people who make less money to the people who made more money. Okay, so that's reason number one. If you filed with direct deposit and they have your payment information to automatically do it, you probably got your check or your money, not your check, but in your bank account. Uh, and if you signed up at the payment portal and just didn't get it yet, you got to be a little bit patient, okay? Uh, a lot of people have a date and it says it's going to be delivered, you know, May 10th. And it might come a couple days before, it might come a week after, but it's going to be around that date. So go ahead and take a look at your bank account. You might have gotten it already, but they're usually within a week of targeting date, uh, according to reports that I've seen. So um, if you also, if they gave you a date and you signed up at the portal, then awesome. You're good to go, right? So just got a little bit, got to be patient with getting your check. Okay. Um, so number two, reason number two, where um, if you didn't get it, you probably didn't file banking info maybe on the portal. You can fix this, okay? So if you filed your tax returns and you had direct deposit, you probably already got your money if you qualified. So, But maybe you filed your returns and you didn't put direct deposit on payment information, right? So they don't have that information. So they're going to have to write you a check with snail mail and it's going to take a long time. What you can do to speed that up is go to the portal and enter your banking info, and then they're going to do the direct deposit electronically, takes all the middleman out of it, and they can just get it done. You'll get it a lot quicker. So go ahead and send them your bank, give them your banking info. Um, reason number three, people who are on Social Security started getting their checks this week, and it's probably coming very soon if you are a filer on Social Security. They should have all your info uh, as long as it's up to date. If it's outdated, I'll get to that in a second, then there might be some trouble with you getting your money, okay? Um, if you get your social security with a paper check for some reason, um, and you prefer to get the paper checks, you're going to get your stimulus with the paper check. Okay. And that's going to take longer. Uh, number four, there's VA benefits, uh, disability payments. Those also started going out about a week ago. And the same goes for uh, paper check versus direct deposit. If you sign up and you get your VA benefits or disability via a paper check, it's going to take longer to get it. If it's been by direct deposit, you should get your money very soon. If you haven't gotten it already, go ahead and check your bank account. Okay. There's also a group of people who might not qualify at all um, for these. And it's a large portion of the population that you're not going to get any money. Okay. So if you're a child uh, over 17 or at college, you don't get the money, the stimulus money. Okay. So there's some debate about whether that's right or wrong. And there's a bill that's on the Hill prepared to change that, but we don't know if it's going to pass yet. So uh, children over 17 or at college aren't getting the stimulus money. Okay. Uh, likewise, if you made over $75,000 as a single filer or $150,000 as a couple, you probably don't qualify. All right. So you're probably not going to get your money. You can go to the portal and fill out information and check it out and see if they'll give you a date or not. 
That's what I recommend doing. If you used a tax service and didn't have your payment information on file, they're going to send the money via snail mail, old fashioned envelope and stamp and all that stuff. And that's going to take a while. Um, but you can update your information on the tax website, on the portal. You can update this information to speed it up. Are you seeing there's a trend here, right? And also there's been reports of banks rejecting payments because the information is out of date. Maybe you're somebody who didn't file for years and there's an old address and there's no good contact information. So you didn't, you're not going to get your money because they don't know where to send it. Unclaimed money. So once again, go to the um, site, the portal, update your info, and hopefully you'll get money soon. Okay? So I told you this was going to be short and sweet. And it was, please subscribe and like, and we can get this going where you get your payments and you can learn a lot more about what I do for a day job and how I'm able to do all these updates and current events and everything. My name is Blue Hair Dave. I'm an affiliate marketer. I do digital marketing and I've been working at home for over 13 years and I teach people uh, different ways they can work more efficiently from home and how they can make a living working from home for themselves uh, or even for somebody else at home. Okay. So go ahead and check all that good stuff. I have a free training in the link below and it's absolutely free. So I hope to see you on board. Take care. Bye-bye.